Oh, hi. Wow, you decided to stick around. Awesome. Thank you so much for continuing to watch the vlog, even though all the interesting people are gone. Nah, I'm just kidding. Well, sort of. They are interesting. Uh, they're funny, they're characters, but I, I do really appreciate you guys to continuing to watch. So, since you are continuing to watch, let me explain what's going on today. I'm meeting up with my friend Seth, who I've met up with before, um, a lot in the uh, some of the early vlogs, and then I think back in March, there was a vlog where I talked about uh, how you have these friends who are timeless or something like that, and I had dinner with them at Chili's. Anyway, we're going to meet for lunch today, I gotta go pick them up, and we're gonna get some wings or chicken or something. Wings are chicken. Or chicken are wings. I don't know if I mentioned this on the vlog, although I think I did, but it was like several hundred days ago, that his sister went to Africa um, as a missionary, and she's been there for like two years or something, and he hasn't been able to see her, so he actually got all his shots and stuff, which I'm assuming there are a lot, and he is leaving on Tuesday to go to Africa, which is similar to me, because I'm going to Wisconsin, except, you know, that's in totally different directions. All right, we got some food here. Well, I don't even know what this is. Oh, hey, I haven't shown you. Seth, how are you? Oh, I didn't know. Seth's going to be in Africa for an entire month. That's an entire month. That's a long time. I have a beard. So you'll be safe. Um, I don't know what everything is. That's the chicken feathers with... Uh, Gold Rush. Gold Rush. Nuggets with Parme flame, flame and Parmesan. Flame and Parmesan. And chicken fingers with... Um, Ranchalada. Ranchalada. And then buffalo... Some... Buffalo chips. With blue cheese, cheese Southwest yeah. Ranch, something. This looks awesome. I haven't eaten this in a long time. I need a chicken, and I don't eat right at school, so I'm going to get chicken. I'm excited that I'm here with you, eating chicken. I'm excited that you're here with me, and I'm here with you. We're here together. I'm kind of excited for your beard, too. It's good. It was really awesome getting to see Seth again. I don't see him very often, and he is going to be in Africa for an entire month. That's crazy. I mean, that's not as crazy as his sister, who's been there for like two years, but still, being in Africa for a month is pretty crazy. What I'm really excited about, and what you guys are probably aware of, is that I get my Mal back tomorrow. My Mal, my Mallory, me and Mallory, together, tomorrow. But the big deal here is that as of tomorrow, life begins. I mean, we don't have to ever say goodbye again. As of tomorrow, we're together forever. That is a huge deal. By the time some of you are watching this, I'll probably be there. I'll actually be in Wisconsin by 12 Central tomorrow, by noon. I will be there, so... If you guys are not already subscribed to me on Twitter, then subscribe, or follow, or whatever it is called on Twitter. Um, I'll be tweeting whenever I'm there and get there and stuff, so you'll be able to kind of keep up until I'm able to release vlogs. And the vlogs will be a little slow, because not only is the internet slow, but I'm editing on a laptop. That's never fun. Something else worth noting is the soda challenge ended, and I know I said something about it the other day, but they didn't talk much about it. It was just kind of like, we're graduating in the soda challenge, da -da -da. we're graduating! Which I think is fairly understandable since we were graduating, it was a big deal, college is over, blah blah blah. But the soda challenge did end, and I was really curious to see how you guys did. But some of you are probably anxious to see what I'm going to do, and I know that specifically because Wally Cube actually asked that explicitly. He said, I want to know what you're going to do. Well, this is what I'm going to do. That's good. You're probably saying, Stephen, did you learn a thing? You went 60 days without bringing soda into the dorm, you drank nothing but water and green tea, and suddenly you're just going back on everything and drinking a soda. Well, that's true, I guess. I mean, I, I did only drink water and green tea while I was in the dorm. When I went out, every once in a while I would have a, a sweet tea or a soda, but in the dorm, no. And it's also worth mentioning that when we started the soda challenge, I had three green apple sodas, and I never drank them, though I was entitled to. I never cleaned up my soda. I just started right then, only water and green tea. But the challenge wasn't formed so you would never drink soda again. It was formed so you could make better decisions and learn a little bit about how much you were drinking. I know a lot of people commented when we started that they were drinking a ton of soda. And just maybe a week or so in, they realized how much they were drinking. Some people might have, uh, you know, several cans a day, and that's not okay. That's never okay for anybody. So, to Wally Cube and to the other people who are watching, if you want my answer of what I'm doing, I am drinking soda. However, the soda challenge has taught me that I can certainly go without soda. I can drink far less, so that's what I'm going to be doing. Soda is a treat, and I was drinking about maybe one soda a day, and I'm cutting back to probably one a week. So I hope you've learned something from the Soda Challenge, and my advice is to enjoy yourself, enjoy life. Life is short, but do so in moderation. 
take uh, into consideration the fact that this stuff kills you. It is not good for you. So, try to cut back. That's my answer. And that's it. I'm going to go ahead and end it here. That's as long as the vlog is going to be. I'm terribly excited that I get to see Mallory tomorrow, but I also have to go to bed, and it's only 9.45 p.m., but my flight's really, really early, so i got to go to bed. The vlog is definitely going to be delayed while I'm there because slow internet and the laptop sucks. Steven Plays, however, will not because they've already been uploaded and scheduled, and that's awesome. Thank you, YouTube, for that feature. So once again, thanks for watching, and let's meet back tomorrow, shall we, whenever Mallory will be on the vlog once again. Forever. That's awesome. Do you guys realize how awesome it is? That's so awesome! Oh, and one more thing. The, uh, the Do Not Enter Ravenholm sign that I asked if anybody wanted and you could send me a message. Uh, the winner, I guess, winner? Winner? Of that is Matthew Vlog, Paul, who we actually met in person. He was the first person to send me a message uh, asking if he could have it. Uh, the second person that sent a message that was very, very close was Final Starman DX, and the third person was TDWPGuy42. So all of you were actually really, really close to getting me the message first, but Matthew Vlog won it. So Matthew Vlog, you are getting the sign. I will mail it out in the morning.